Okay, what I'm looking at here is I took a piece of um, alpine tundra, so about 12,500 feet uh, last fall, and it's been growing under a light ever since, along daylight, so it thinks it's uh, summer. And what's happened is, um, you know, various things have been growing. But uh, my native clover has uh, decided to bloom, which allows me to identify it. So, three leaf um, uh, leaflets. It's a um, trifolium, and uh, it's fairly obviously a clover. It's actually aromatic, uh, but this is a native clover by the name of Kingsi. Um, but along here, along with this, there's a little geum, and then some phlox uh, relatives, and a, um, a juncus. But the, uh, the headline here is this guy, um, in which I've, uh, depending on the book you're looking at, is a Salix petrophylla. Uh, so it's a um, Ar Arctica variety petrophyllum. So this is a willow, and uh, under um, cold temperatures it'll stay close to the ground, but uh, it is now venturing upwards um, because it's uh, spent, uh, uh, let's say, four or five months in uh, my apartment um, and growing. So anyway, there you go. That's a native clover. That is not something you see too often, and certainly neither uh, the Arctic willow. Um, so anyway, there you go.